Hello everybody, my name is Jared and welcome to Jar Red Gaming. Welcome back to World of Horror. You guys seem to really enjoy it and I enjoyed the heck out of it, so I'm going to play it some more. Last time we played, we played the spine-chilling story of School Scissors. So this time, let's move on to the second one. Let's just go down the list here. Extracurricular activity. City of Shiokawa, Japan, 1980X. Something strange. Yes, robed figures. Buxom, faceless people. Malicious elder gods coming down. It's all up to us. The town of doom. The missing stars. Media reports on various people with seemingly supernatural skills. Could it have any connection with the news about stars disappearing from the night sky? Hmm. Old God's Rule. Casting spells raise doom instead of its normal cost. I still don't know what doom is in this game. So this is different. We're a different person, too. You've learned a new spell. Regeneration. Cool. What's that do? Gain two stamina of the cost of our reason, or I'm assuming... I think reason is our sanity. Uh, let's see here. Our home. You check your mailbox. It is empty. Um... Something's trying to get out of that one, though. Oh, okay. Oh. Back in your home, you think of your next move. You are not currently investigating any weird mystery. Recent newspaper clippings and notes collected in the next room should point you in the right direction. Choose an action. Start a new mystery. Ooh, what? Move curtain? Is it going to rain? I don't know. What an interesting observation. Why can we interact with that? It's so random. <laughs> Well, let's start a new... Oh. Watch TV, take a bath, change clothes. Take a peek through the peephole. Oh. Interesting. Wow, we can do oh, so many more things. Hmm. Why can we watch TV and bathe and stuff? Does that increase our reason or something? I don't know. Let's just start a new mystery. Inexplicable and morbid events are plaguing your town for some time now. You've marked down five of them, hoping that there was something connecting them. You can tackle these five mysteries in any order you want. Beware, your decision will haunt you and influence yet unsolved mysteries. Hmm. Oh my. Oh my, oh my. <laughs> Alarming account of abnormal arms. Horrible history of household hell. Eerie episode of evolving eels. Vicious verses of a violent vigil. Rotten report of a rancid ramen. <laughs> it's all alliteration. I love it. I love it. Let's just start. Let's go left to right. Let's just do um, ab alarming account of abnormal arms. Just because that sounds really weird. Ooh. The alarming account of abnormal arms. I remember when it started. The woman next door was strangled to death in her bed, with no sign of forced entry. The killer was never found, and the apartment remained vacant. Let's investigate the mystery. To advance this mystery, investigate the circled location. As you progress, the location and rules may change. Whoa, there's so much more. <laughs> the door to her apartment was closed and she lived alone. What other ways in are there? Maybe you can get the apartment plan to compare with other flats. Investigate the hospital location twice to complete this quest. You can't investigate your home. Travel to downtown. It's circled, like it said. Police station. Shop for items. There's a little dog. Costs doom to enter. So strange. Well, let's just let's just investigate downtown for now. I don't. <laughs> I don't know. Here we are investigating downtown. Oh, towering eyes. Profit. People in Poington talk about a man on the other side of the street. He looks confused, muttering to himself while occasionally touching a festering wound on his cheek. You stop in your tracks and listen to the man's cursed incantation. Well, why did we do that? Negative two reason, but we gain a spell. Seal of Bramel? What is that? Plus one knowledge, discard on use at the cost of four reason. Uh, what's the point? What is knowledge used for? I don't know. Travel to apartments. Neighbor, cost doom. Well, let's just see what happens. Apartment corridor. You knock on your friend's door and wait. Huh? Kana's not home. I should check on her later. Okay, well, that cost us doom then and for nothing. 
for nothing. I don't I don't know what that means still. Alright, well let's it's we gotta go to the circled ones, so we're at the apartments, let's investigate the apartments. Nothing bad's gonna happen to me. Mail day! When you stop by home to pick up your lunch, you find a pile of letters in your mailbox. Let's read them. Luck check success. Sweet, it seems that you won a small amount of money in the lottery. Lucky you. Plus two to funds. Hell yeah, we got money for something. I don't even know where our money is listed, so I have no I have no idea how much money we even have. Alright, well, let's continue in... What's going on up here? What is going on up here? You notice the odd placement of ventilation shafts. They seem too small for anyone to crawl through. Okay, well, let's continue to investigate the apartments, I guess. <laughs> Stargazing. Your friend has asked you to meet them at a certain secluded location. Getting there, you find a telescope with a note signed by your friend. The note tells you to look through the telescope. Curious, you check it out. You don't see anything at first. Then you notice it, the bloated body of Athiolus, is getting closer. <gasps> Who is that? <laughs> is that one of the Eldritch Gods or something? What in the world? Investing? How do? How do we investigate the hospital location twice? Where's the hospital? I'm already there, according to everything. You should interview the neighbors. Maybe you'll discover something the police missed. Just keep searching the apartments, I guess. Ooh! Raining blood. A woman jumps out of her apartment covered in goo. Between sobs, she tries to explain what happened. She was taking a shower and suddenly the shower head started spraying blood. A trail of blood leads into the dark apartment. Well, let's try to calm her down. Lady, you need to calm down. Never mind, I failed the charisma check. When you touch her shoulder, she gets hysterical. Her reaction shook her reaction shocks you. You move away as more neighbors enter the corridor. Dag gummit. Oh, hello. One neighbor is complaining about her underwear missing. It wasn't I. Oh dear. Um <laughs> Sorry. I did not steal your underwear. Fire escape investigation. Uh-oh. You hear the rustling on the other side of the apartment door. Someone is trying to get in. Crap, we don't have a weapon. I just realized. Dang it, he's got 24 HP. Apartment stalker. Crap, we have no weapon. Oh no. Uh, I think we can look f We can look for improvised weapon. Let's do that. And then try to kick him, I guess. I don't know what else to do. Oh no. Oh, we've... Wait, 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 wait. The, he bashes us in the head with a baseball bat? Oh my gosh, we have a concussion. We are so screwed. But I think we f we found something, didn't we? Concussion. Oh. I have no available actions. Ow, my head. <laughs> uh, broken bottle. It's better than nothing. Okay. You're going down, biatch. And we missed. He's probably going to kill us first. He keeps hitting us in the head with a baseball bat. Damn it! <laughs> Do we have any s spells that would be of any use to us? We have regeneration. Well, I don't really think I need to use that yet. Let's just keep attacking him. Oh my gosh. Oh man, I don't think we're gonna make it, guys. Uh-oh, uh-oh, I did it the wrong way, I did it the wrong way. Crap. We keep missing. That's the thing. Like, we if we didn't miss half of our attacks, he only does two damage. I feel like we just gotta keep attacking until we get his health down. <sighs> I don't know. I think we're gonna die. <laughs> we were not ready for this battle. Oh my goodness. Okay, we should win here. You defeated the apartment stalker. Wait, what was that? Oh, we got a baseball bat. Now we have a baseball bat. That would have really come in handy before. Oh my gosh, we're almost freaking dead now, though. Second neighbor is complaining about weird noises coming from the vents when she's at home. Well, oh my gosh, let's use our regeneration and get some health back. I don't know. Oh, we can use it more than once? Did it work? If I feel like it didn't work. Oh, it does work. Okay. Good. That's it. That's all we'll do. We won't do any more. I don't know. It's not, It doesn't seem to be costing us reason, but I think our doom is going up. I still don't know what doom is. Oh, travel to hospital. Well, son of a... 
I didn't know. It was saying we were already there. You find yourself in an old, unused part of the hospital. You take a deep breath. That disgusting smell and thawed remains still lingers in the room. It used to be the hospital's mortuary where doctors determined the causes of death. Oh, we can s let's search the cabinet. Failure. We suck at just about everything, apparently. Something flashes in the corner of the desk drawer to let you realize it's a rusty scalpel blade and you cut yourself badly. Awesome. God, we fail at every check. Paranoid patient. When the patient came home one morning covered in scars and babbling about aliens, the police had them committed. They're mumbling something quietly as you pass by. Talk to them. Needs paranoia status? Christmas check. Failure. And we got hurt because you tried to reason with them. You tell them what really happened, but it doesn't work. It takes two nurses to calm them down after they've roughed you up. Great. Well, we achieved something. An anatomical museum archive displays a specimen with elongated arms and jellyfied bones. Negative one reason. We are just getting negative everything. So now what do we need to do? We still need to go to the apartments, I think. It's still circled. I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. Oh yeah, we're searching for something. I don't remember now. Our master is coming, and we all can bask in its glory. Okay. Oh, magician glitched. Oh my gosh. Oh dear. He does doom damage. What the heck? Okay, I'm gonna try attack boost. And then prepare attack, and then strong attack, and then and then we'll kick him. Let's see how that goes. Oh, hell yeah! Oh, magician saps strength from you. Oh crap! <laughs> but we hit him. We hit him both times, which that's like the first time that's happened. I bashed and kicked the magician for eight health total. Let's let's do that again. The attack boost it stacks so. That could be good, because that's going to increase our um, chances of actually hitting. Which seems to be working, because we're hitting both times. We can do it. We can do it. Uh, this should do it. This should beat him. <laughs> Defeated the damn magician. Give me that experience. New achievement unlocked. Ooh. How nice. <laughs> Let's check the building plan to find out if there's a place where all the vents connect. Okay, do it. <laughs> we are at 30% doom. I don't, I still don't know what that means. We're probably doing this completely wrong. I should probably look this stuff up, but oh well. <laughs> Let's continue to investigate the apartments. The lobby. Visitor, loud knocking wakes you up in the middle of the night. Open up, shouts the deep voice from behind the door. I know you're there. Get closer to the door and ask what's the matter or call the police. I feel like calling the police would be pointless in this situation. Let's... Oh, dexterity check success. Before you can answer the door's letterbox suddenly opens and an unknown invader tries to look inside. Luckily, you manage to stand still. After a couple of minutes, the man retreats, probably unsure if you're home at all. Five experience. Hell yeah! Finally success. That's something. Every room is connected by vents coming from the unused boiler room. Could it be? Hmm. Target location, investigate the boiler room. Ooh, oh, we've got, like, blood on our thing here now. Why? <laughs> Why? All right, let's... I'm gonna heal up a little bit. I know it's costing us doom, but I still don't know what doom is, and I just kind of want to get through this without freaking dying, because I know we're gonna end up having to fight a boss or something. So let's let's investigate the boiler room. Ooh, boiler room. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Look at that hand! You enter the dark boiler room and trip over pipe, cursing. You find a light switch and gasp in horror. It's not a pipe at all. It's his dick. Nope, it's a. It's not. It's not. It's a long rubbery arm coiling around the room and ending in the ventilation shaft. Coming closer, you can smell something vile and rotten. I don't want to check the vent, but I have no other choice. Ooh. Hello, vent. Oh God, what the fuck? I found a new item, a tiny key. Didn't we need a tiny key at the school? I, I don't know if it's, the, I doubt it's the same key. You almost fall to the ground and when you see the wide open stare of a dead pervert, his elongated limbs stretching and disappearing in vent's darkness. Inside his mouth, you find a tiny key. So he's dead. There's an eyeball. 
there's an eyeball there. Why is there an eyeball there? Um, okay. After the police arrived, the whole building was searched. Following the arms, detectives find a body of a man stuck in a ventilation shaft. Later, he is identified as the building caretaker. In his closet, police find pieces of underwear and voyeur photos of the tenants. I don't know why, but this 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 sort of feels like the X Files, but like in Japan, and that's really cool. Okay, tiny key can be used to open certain locks. Can we go back to the school? Because that's the only place that I remember seeing. Oh wait, the old god stirs. Click here to reveal its effect. Roads closed. Roads leading out of town were closed by the police. You'll have to find a new way out. Okay. A feeling of paranoia and discomfort is almost palpable in the air as doom progresses old gods. Influence will slowly corrupt and change this calm seaside town. So the more doom we accumulate, the weirder things get, maybe? <laughs> interesting. Very interesting. What's the lighthouse? The ominous lighthouse has been closed down for longer than you can remember. Leave or enter? Uh, I'll enter, I guess. I don't know what it is. Multiple padlocks are you from entering the building. It needs five keys. Is that what the tiny key is for? Maybe? You don't have... No. These are special keys. Okay. Okay. Interesting. Hmm. Must be the end, um... Must be the end result, like, getting in there. I guess we go back home. Inside your mailbox, you find a small key. What is it doing in there? <gasps> Now we have a key to the lighthouse, perhaps. I'm assuming there's five mysteries we have to solve. And at the end of each mystery, we get a key to the lighthouse. And if we can get into the lighthouse before we get to 100% doom, which I'm assuming is bad, maybe we win. <laughs> I don't know. Ah, yes. Yeah, so we've completed one of our mysteries. There's four to go. But I think that's where I'll end this video, guys. I will save the next mystery for the next video. Um, I'm really enjoying the crap out of this game. I think it's extremely unique. It's so much fun. I enjoy the writing and just the weirdness of it. Like I said, it feels like Japanese X-Files. And I love the X-Files. It's one of my favorite TV shows of all time. So I'm really loving this. And I hope you guys are still enjoying this as much as I I am. If you are, please leave a like, leave a comment. I'd love to hear what you guys think of this so far. If you're new to the channel, I would urge you consider subscribing and don't forget to ring the bell and make sure you select all or whatever the option is for the bell um, so that you don't miss out on future videos. I do them every day, so keep that in mind. And as always, thank you so very much for watching. You've been awesome. Let's play again soon and I'll see you in the next video.